Hey guys, um, today we got the uh, Stripe Bell Albino. Um, she laid a couple days ago. Actually, when I recorded her digging, she laid the the next morning. Um, she only laid one egg. I still see the other egg in here, so I'm not too sure when she's gonna drop that one. Um, so and Anthony's uh, laid again. So that's another egg for me. Here's the um, Stripe Bell Albino egg. I'm just doing pretty much like an egg update, you can say. Marked it right there. Um, but yeah, but, uh, I can't really candle it right now because it's just been laid. It really doesn't show for a couple of days. Um, well, there's hers. Um, get in the incubator. Here's the ones that just got laid the day before my stripe all by laid. These eggs are um, a different color. One of them is really huge. It's just this one. This one's... I'm pretty sure they're infertile. I mean, I can feel it. Like, they feel like a hot water balloon. That usually it means that they're not fertile. But, you know, always keep them in there just in case. Yep. So there's hers. And then this is the first clutch that she laid. The eggs are fantastically healthy. Uh, it's been 30, 30, uh, 40 days since, um, they were laid. So, they can, uh, hatch them about in a week. Hopefully, um, since I'm incubating at, let's see, around 83, 82.5. Um, as you can see, they're both really big. Way bigger than what they were in the beginning. See, these ones feel, like, really healthy. You can just tell by just looking at them. Um, anyways, yeah, here's the eggs, I'm incubating for females, just, um, because, um, I'm just getting a little low right now, um, but, it's pretty simple, I just, uh, go in here, always have my temperature thing, just so I make sure that everything's good, and here's what it looks like. This incubator is working out pretty good so far. Yep, so hopefully I'll start you know, getting more eggs and everything. I got a couple that are pregnant actually right now. So yeah, thanks for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe.